So Charter of Trust is basically collaboration between many industry leaders that are playing in this smart technology. There is really a need for a team-based solution around uh, designing safety into our products, our world, our environment. Well, I would rate trust as the most critical aspect of us as a society trusting in their devices and being able to continue to modernize our infrastructure and digital transformation. We need to make sure we keep trust as a focal point of how we deliver that value to society. One of the things we need to build into technology is the ability to rapidly move quickly in the defense space. So we need to build agility into these products so we can adapt as we invariably learn on a day-to-day -day basis. The way that the technologies would garner the user's trust is starting with clear and mandatory requirements on safety and security. These mandatory requirements would eventually get translated into standards that would touch on confidentiality, integrity, and authenticity of the devices and services. But we cannot wait for that regulatory framework to come into place. So many of the companies that are part of a Charter of Trust are implementing it on their own. NXP Connect, it's been fascinating to see that cross-pollinization amongst multiple domains in this one environment really packed a lot of insightful value capture. I think NXP Connect is great. It's a great technology form. There's some leading edge technology and it really makes you think about the future. I'm hoping that in the next few years when we get together again, security would not be considered an afterthought but actually a primary consideration in the overall design of this digital transformation that we are going through. This is going to be a challenge, but there is a roadmap and we're all working on that together.